Hey guys, I'm back with another video. Um, to the guy who requested Metal Gear Solid Sons of Liberty, sorry I've been a little bit late. I've been working, so um, yeah. But yeah, this is one of those games where it's just a little weird. Like sometimes it works really well, and then other times it doesn't work good at all. Um, but I'll show you anyway. It's not something I think you could play through the game. I mean, you could put up with it. But, um, yeah, I don't know, boys and girls. It's one of those things. So I'm going to clear the... Uh, now, there's a few things you can do, which I'll show you anyway. But we'll skip all this because this is intro is huge. So push start button. Um, I have got a save state. I was playing this a few days ago. But we'll go into new game. We'll go first time. We'll just go easy. Please. I'll go back for a sec. Hang on. I want to go easy. Yeah, that's all good. We'll go easy just just to, for this playthrough. Well, not playthrough, but yeah, just to show you. Just go with the normal. Action level selected. Metal Gear Solid 2, Sons of Liberty, will now begin. Please enjoy. But just to uh, go into the settings to show you guys what I have it at, uh, at the moment, I don't think I've changed it. I might have to change it. One thing you can do, though, I've got it at Vulcan one times... What you can do, though, is go into blending accuracy. Now, this, the higher you go, obviously, the harder it is to emulate. So we'll go on basic and see if that makes a difference. The only problem is you will get um, some graphical issues here and there. Uh, ESOC at 100%. I'm pretty sure I might have to change that. We'll go mold underclock 2. We want to try and keep that one 100% if we can. Uh, the underclock... You know, you just got to play around with it, but um, yeah, it's best to keep that at one or two if you can. Um, and I have it at 110%, which is a little fast, but it gives you that extra oomph. So we'll go back to graphics. I have it at Vulcan, uh, one times native. You might have to go down to 7.75 only because it still suffers from slowdown. Um, we might change that to OpenGL. We'll see how we go. We'll have to skip this because, you know, obviously, the intro again. I mean, Snake, do you remember the sinking of that tanker two years ago? Even the video seems to work all right. But as soon as you the start of this with the rain, it just can chug. It didn't take long for the government to put an oil fence around the whole mess. And then that massive offshore cleanup was So we'll skip this. Unless you want to watch the whole intro. So I haven't played this at basic. Um, I played it at medium. But as soon as I got to the first boss, it just chugged, man. It, just got, it was really, really slow. Sorry it's a little bit dark in here, guys, but I've closed everything just so I can, you guys can see the screen better. How are things? We're in luck. Looks like there are no... Oh, that's weird. You don't start as... Uh, depending on your difficulty, you don't start as... Uh, snake. The texture isn't far removed from rubber, but the material... Yeah, yeah, see how you get... There's a bit of... Graphical issues there. The hatch with a yeah, come on, we want to skip all this. We don't want to read all this. It's all good. So we're not starting in the rain this time. We're starting in. So it all depends. Well, I didn't know that. It all depends on who, what difficulty level. But as you can see, it is running pretty good at the moment. So what we'll do, I'll go into the settings again, uh, just just to show you a second time, so you know what I've got it at. 100% cycle rate, uh, moderate underclock 2, cycle skip, 110%, uh, 
uh, graphics we have Vulcan, one times native. But just remember, guys, blending accuracy. Go medium or basic to give you that extra... Oh, look, at that's too bright. Sorry, guys. To give you that extra frames per second. So I've got it on basic at the moment. Um, so, yeah, just remember that one, guys, blending accuracy. So we'll get out of here now. So I'm getting... It's the PAL version. I'm getting 54, 56 because I've got that 110 percent on. So we'll skip all this. Right, that door is watertight. Turn the handle to open the door. Face the. So he plays right in first when you choose diff easy difficulty. That's interesting. Because when I did, and this is what you get also. I noticed this: the first person stuff. It's all weird. So you can't really go into first person with this guy because of the mask. I might change it to OpenGL, I might fix it. Colonel, I've sighted an enemy sentry. Skip all this. Now I've got to get USP, is it? See, if I go into first person with the mask on, it does this. What I might do, if I go to OpenGL, it might fix it up. We'll see what happens. Um, sorry you're playing around with this, guys, but it shows you... Yeah, no, it's not fixing it up. But um, the game seems to be working fine. But what I'll do... We'll skip all this. I'll go into my load state. Because... This is my other game that I started just before the boss. As you can see, it's a lot slower here because of the rain. So we'll skip this. It's going to be hard playing this through the camera. But I mean, it's playable if you're willing to put up with a bit of slowdown here and there. The boss fight is really slow. We'll see how we go. As you can see, even this is slower. We'll go, so what we'll do, we'll go back to Vulcan. See if that makes any difference. I'm sorry I'm chopping and changing, guys, but Off the coast of the Bermudas. there we go. The Keep that in Vulcan, guys. Don't put it in OpenGL. Keep it in Vulcan. That area is outside the Second Fleet's operational range, too. It must be a standalone Marine Corps project, which means this prototype Metal Gear must be designed for in... So we'll try and do the boss through the camera. Um, I don't think I'll be able to do it. There's the boss there. But I'll show you... But you can see it's working decent. So just remember to blend blending accuracy on basic. Oh, I need that. Give me that. There we go. And you should be good with this game. I'm pretty sure the boss fight will slow down though. So we'll skip this. Yeah, see how it slows down? It's slowing down big time here. I mean, it's playable, but it's slowing down. It's not too bad. So just, all you got to remember, guys, put the blending accuracy to... I mean, you could also put it to 0.75 for some of the boss fights just to get it. But it seems to be working okay now. Oh, shit, oh, she shoot me, bro. Ah, oh, not quick enough. It's a bit hard. I'm trying to play through the uh, phone, but it's not. It's not easy. Oh god, I want to shoot this. This is what I want to shoot. I want to shoot that. See, there's a bit of graphical issues there. I've got it on easy, so she won't be able to kill me. Oh, dude, I can't see him. It's hard to see him. I'm trying to play through... <laughs> looking over the phone. It's not easy. But it's working. I mean, it might get slower during the other parts of the game, but oh, I'm going to die. I oh, know, I've got rations. How many rations have I got? Seven. I can't see, bro. 
got a I'll ship I'll kill this girl and then um I'll Oh dude. I'm not very good. Through this. I beat it before and it's easier, but trying to record and play is not easy. I'm, oh, dude, I'm sure I picked her up then. Oh, she's too good, bro. There we go. Anyway, guys, that is Metal Gear Solid Sons of Liberty. Metal Gear Solid 2. And, uh, yeah, hope you guys enjoyed that. Um, sorry for the late video. Uh, on this one, I said I was working and um, I'd come home and I'd want to do it and then I wouldn't do it. So, apologise. But that's um, that's pretty much it. Eleven minutes. See you guys. Thank you for watching, and I'll catch you later.